So today I'm going to show you how to fix your Tipex Mini Pocket Mouse in case you have a broken or torn tape. I'll also show you how to open it so you can skip ahead to that point in the video. I'll leave a timestamp in the description. The first thing we want to do is get a little bit of material to work with. So we'll pull on both of these at the same time. You might have to fight it a little bit as it pulls against that wheel. We need a little bit of material to work with. The next thing we need to do, since we'll be taping it together, is we need to clean off this bit of whiteout. So just take a piece of paper and you can just press, press it down in the paper. And now we have a clean surface that the tape can stick to. Now, take a length of tape on a surface you can cut on, tape down one end, sticky side up, so loop it back around on itself, tape the other end down to the surface, get it nice and flat, and then we can take, we can take one end of this, and we'll place it, we'll place it along the edge of this tape, about halfway across, and then we'll take the other side, being careful not to twist it, we want a nice flat continuous band, and I'll tape it right to the end, just like that, make sure it's nice and stuck, and then we need to cut off that extra tape, so if you take a ruler and stick it right along the edge, and a razor blade, tape should come up with the ruler. You still have these ends that are stuck down, so I'll slice that one off and slice this one off. I want to make sure these, the ends of the tape aren't going to get caught on anything, so make sure those are stuck down. And now we have a continuous band ready to be fed back into the dispenser. So one way to do that is to use this little this little hole here and take like a screwdriver something like that and turn counterclockwise and that'll help take in the slack but the problem is when you turn the collection wheel it also turns the feed wheel so this actually fed out a little bit of this and so it's kind of a wasteful way of doing it so the alternative is to open this up a good way to open this i found is by taking a pair of scissors and sticking it in the top right in here and then prying open and as long as you don't cut the tape again um, you should be able to get one end of it open and then if you take a gift card or credit card or something like that you can run it around the edge and that'll help get it open and then before you take it fully apart, I would recommend having the black band on, facing up on the top side. And then you can open that up. I'll take in a little bit on this wheel here. So I'm going to hold the collection wheel and turn the feed wheel a little bit. And then I'll do the opposite. So I'll hold the feed wheel and I'll turn the collection wheel. And we're going to use a screwdriver to do that. And it's counterclockwise. And you can see I've taken in all that slack. It's nice and flat. The tape is away from the edge. And so I'm ready to put the cover back on, snap it in place, and then we should be good to try it out. And it looks like it works just as normal. And that's all there is to it. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you found this video helpful.